show your support, like, share and subscribe. Hello, I am that British guy and welcome back to WrestleGamia, my playthrough series of Shut Your Mouth's Season Mode. Now in the last video, Ric Flair won out over Vince McMahon and is now the sole owner of the WWE. So what will happen next? Let's find out. Right, I am just going to sort of carry on through. Um, I've kind of given up with the whole let's see if I can get any belts. Obviously next month will be the Royal Rumble, so it would be quite nice to win that and go on to the main event of WrestleMania. But for the time being, I'm just going to see where season mode takes me. I'm presuming it's going to lead into the whole Ric Flair on his own. Yeah, there we go. New owner. So, we'll see where that leads me. I mean, it might lead me to a title match. We had an ending to our feud last night, but believe me, it's not over yet. Because a true winner should be decided by an official title match. Sure, don't have any right to say that, but... As the one who truly devotes my life for the undisputed title, Survivor Series is now over. over. Now our Armageddon will begin. Mm. How's that gonna? Am I gonna be able to win the undisputed title before that? It's just like what you hear. You want to be in this title match? Hell yeah! I have to wait to see your performance. I've got like 93 points or something ridiculous. Ah. Uh, okay. Problem is, last time I faced Jericho, I did actually lose, so there is that, I guess. But, hey. This is a turn up for after Survivor Series. It's more interesting than what we got out of the actual Survivor Series ma uh, matches and card. Because, well, Raw meant absolutely nothing, even though they managed a clean sweep, in inverted commas. A 6-1 clean sweep. At least this one's actually got some kind of payoff, still. Mm. So I could be the cruiserweight... European and Undisputed Champion. That'd be nice. Do miss this old belt. It was nice. I think they're a bit... Meh now. They don't look very prestigious. They don't look very fancy and ornate. It's just... Uh, branding. Here's a massive logo. Come on to the apron then, you idiot. Yeah, it's just, here's a massive logo. Enjoy. At least then there was a bit of kind of decorativeness about them. Made them feel a bit special. Down you get, Booker. Ah, stupid ref. Hey ref, don't blame me, get him out. He's not meant to be there. Come on, Booker, get up. Ball. Come on, Booker, fight me. There he come. You will fight me whether you want to or not. special. Ah, still sort of got him. <laughs> oh, don't pin him. Pin the not legal man by the not legal man. 
Come on, Austin, get me in this match. It's my turn now. Come on. Uh, come on, Austin. There you go. Oh, get off, ref. Come on, Austin. <coughs> Come on. Yeah. Oh, you... Ugh, you idiot. You wasted my finisher, you damn fool. Ugh. What earth is wrong with you, you plum? Right, I need you to hurry up and get your own finisher, get in this ring, and hit... Oh. Oh, heaven over there. <laughs> oh. No! <laughs> team right there would be like opposite team members. Going down, Booker. Good job I've already worked on you a bit. <laughs> get off. Get up, get up, get up. Nope. For a cruiserweight, it's someone one moves, and I'll take a while to hit. Not good, not good, not good. Aha. Better. You can hopefully get hit by the stunner. Well, at least give me a chance to get out of the blooming ring, ref. God, talk about impatient. Jeez. Go on, hit him. Oh, come on. Come on, Booker, go to hit him with a move. Okay, we're back on Jerry. Yeah. Are we? Come on, Austin. Come on. Somebody use a finisher on someone. Do a finisher. Ah! Screw you, Booker. Hey! Didn't even come in the ring! That was handy. Unlucky, Booker! Come on, that's got to put me in contention then for a title match. Mr. Flair. Da 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 I mean it might put Austin in contention, but who is he really? He's he's nothing. So Flair, what do you think? Was that enough? Do I get a title match? Do I at least get a number one contenders match? I want to smack down again. So what is my ranking then, very very quickly, if they're checking out 99, okay, I can't really get much higher than that. And the fact that they're making me jump through all these hoops, check my performance, come on, do me a favour. I mean, The Rock's only got 95, a measly 95. Oh, battle of the battle. The official battle will start the next pay-per-view. Fine, but only three from each team can be in. 
it'll be a six way match. Hmm. So, what? Three from Raw, three from SmackDown? Is that how it's going? Do you want a singles match tonight or a handicap match? Single match? Why would I want a handicap match? That's just stupid. It's not like I need the points. Do you want a singles match or a handicap match? Um, do you want a fair chance of winning or do you want to make it hard for yourself? See, that's the thing. Was it a handicap where it was two for me and one for them or the other way round? Because you weren't really clear. Do you want one opponent or two opponents is what you should have said. But you didn't. Me against the rock can do this. Easy. Come on. Come on. We can all smell what you've been cooking, Mr. The Rock. Ooh, ah, ah. It's Jeff Hardy again. Oh, you're in the way. Get out of the way of the ring post. There we go, still got you. No! Stop. What? How did that even... I'm not entirely sure what happened there. He kind of punched me and then threw me. on top. Shot shoot to the rock. Get out of that one. Lovely old reverse Rana. Come on, let's put them away nice and quick. Missed. Oh, right on the face. Ow. I'm dragging me. Get up, get up, get up. Get up, get up, get up. That's what you get, boy. Nice little bit of a surfboard. Lovely, lovely. I feel like it might be time. Ah! Stop doing that! Might be time to go outside the ring. No! I'll have you know. Oh. Come here. Not how this was supposed to go, Rock. This is better. What? Clearly, you're on an elevated thing. Do a top rope move. Oh, not good. <laughs> no. No. Ow. Kick me up onto the barricade. What even is that? Why is the referee not counting as well? I mean, why have I set this up to no count out? That's just stupid. <coughs> Get off! Oh, this is not fun. <laughs> Get up. No! crowd wants to see. There we go. Come 
Come on, Rocky. Come on, Rocky. In you get. So not good. Oh no. Get up. Get up. No. Finished by a clothesline. That is not good. Just as he got his special up as well. Was he just ready to get out of the ring? Oh no. What's that? My first loss since Jericho? Damn it. My first pinfall loss since Kurt Angle. My stats are rubbish. Think. Damn it. Does that mean I'm out of contention for the belt now? How's that gonna work? Maybe I should have gone handicap, because then at least I'd have an excuse. And damn it. Although if I win this, I then won't be in the rumble match. I kind of feel like I wanna be in the rumble match. Hmm. Ah well, we'll see. How's this gonna play out? <laughs> Ready for action. Bring it on. Booker T, The Rock and Chris Jericho. Okay, well Jericho makes sense because, you know, he's got the belt. There's no way in hell you can win the belt. See, this doesn't make any sense, because you've got no power anymore. Flair could just, like, veto this whole thing. What do you want, Austin? Tag team partner. We'll be enemies of the pay-per-view. Remember that. Is this going to be a six-man tag where whoever gets the fall gets the belt? Is that how it's going to work? Which is a really dumb way of having a title match and makes zero sense. So who else is going to be on my team then? Me and Austin. And Brock Lesnar probably? He seems to be the other go-to person for my Raw team. They always seem to just drag out um, Austin and Lesnar, usually. Has been the last few months anyway. So I'm presuming that's going to be the case here. Yeah, it must just be a case of whoever gets the pinfall wins the belt. I really hate stipulations like that. It's so attitude era as well, which I suppose makes sense because it just finished. And was probably still underway when the game was made. Ow. Ow. That was a good start. Oh well, that got me back in at least. Ooh, nice. I don't think I've seen that move before. Boy, pink trunks. Whoop. Yeah, gotcha. Uh, what? No. Oh, that could not put him away at all. Now, my low blow kicked me over the rope. 
Oh, there's steps there. Get off. Right, I'm staying in the ring. If anyone wants some of me, you've got to face me in the ring, boy. What the hell is, was that? Did I just stun at him? I didn't even think that was in my moveset. I feel like that was a glitch. Hmm, oh well. I'll take it. Come on, Austin, keep beating him up. Get your special bar up. I'll keep working on this guy. You know, this guy that reckons he can act. Oh, thanks, Jericho. Much help there you were. Cheers, bro. How close to being out, are you? Oh, nice! <laughs> Thanks, Austin. He really must have done a number on him outside. Boom! Take that. No finishes used. Right, one more <coughs> attempt at something before the pay-per-view. And I'm presuming that's where they're going to explain the rules. And Flair's team, I would have thought. Do you want a piece of me? No. Why would I want a piece of him? That's just dumb. I keep him on the side. I want him to do all the work in the tag match so that I can just swoop in. I can Mandy Rose him, get him to do all the work, and then take the pinfall. That's what my plan is. Because I'm a baby face. <laughs> Ooh, no match. Cool. There's a Brock Lesnar match. Brock Lesnar Booker T, which presumably plays into this storyline. about the lost stuff for the Battle of the Bell. Let me introduce my team. Hey, where's me? Why am I not in that team? Oh, it's going to be a Hell in a Cell match, isn't it? Hang on then, so I'm not in the match now. Is that what you're telling me? Why am I not in the match? What, because I didn't attack Austin? Do you know why you weren't chosen? Because you suck. What? I don't get how I just got kicked off the team for no reason. This is ball. Do I get back on the team by winning this match? is absolute ball. Get off for Eagle, Mr. I lost the European belt to you. <clears throat> In fairness, I haven't defended it since then. <laughs> Even though I took it to uh, England. Although I did defend the cruiserweight belt in my like, steel cage match. When I had to do double duty. Oi. Oh man, I'm... I mean, I guess at least then I can be in the Rumble match next month. Which I'd quite like. I want to be in the Rumble match. But if I just got kicked off the team because I didn't attack Austin, that's going to be really annoying. That was a pointless interaction there. Thanks for that, Regal. So if I suck and you lost to me, you must uber suck. Right. Am I seriously just off the team now, then? It must have been because I didn't attack Austin. If so, I call bull on this. I mean, that has got to be the most anticlimactic... Oh, man. That is proper bull. So I'm in a match against William Regal, presumably for the European belt. Ah, oh, I get.
guess the next video at least I'm going to be in the Rumble. But talk about rug pull. That is not on. Ah. Oh. What, what a downer. What an anticlimactic end to how this is going to play out then for the video. Ah. I mean, I guess it gives me a chance to possibly get that Wrestlemania moment as long as I can win the Rumble. I'm presuming this is for the... No, it's not even for the European belt. Oh my god, what is the point of this match? I've already beaten him once. Why am I having to do this again? Ah, oh, what a naff way of ending the blooming month. It must have been because I didn't attack Austin. Because I didn't show that fire or something. That is just stupid. Like, I thought you wanted to win the belt as well. Surely if I'd have roughed up Austin and he'd have roughed up me, we'd have had less chance of winning. Especially if he now wins it. Ah, you missed. Come out here. Come on. Come on. Roughing you up with a chair. Oh, that's not good. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, no good. Don't make me get the chair again, Regal. I will get the chair. Don't think I won't. <laughs> nice holding pattern we're going into here. And then I hit you with the chair, you get up, you take the chair off me, and then that, and then knee smash. <laughs> he runs into the chair. You know what they say? Madness is doing the same thing over and over and over and expecting a different result. And you running towards me like that, Regal, does not help your cause, mate. Oh, in the green. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> Stop running towards me then, you idiot. Ah, that's obviously why. Time it well enough. What? You stopped me mid knee. That's not allowed. Damn you, William. Get off. No, don't hit him. It's not going to work, is it? Idiot. Ow. No. No. Let's not turn this into a hit me with a ladder fest. That's not what the people want to see. I want to see another knee smash. Followed up with more chair shots. I can't actually remember how the ladder mechanic works in this game. Get the... Ow! Pick the ladder up! Oh, God! Nightmare. Oh, you can't move it slightly either. So if you put it in the wrong place, tough, that's where it's going. How do I grab the... Ah! Go on, go on, go on. Down you come. Yes! In your face, Regal, for that pointless match. But I should be, hopefully, in the Royal Rumble next month. Which was more my main intention.
because that would have been a shame to miss that. To change things up a bit at least. And I'm pretty sure there's kind of a fight for the 30 spot as the month goes on, which should be quite interesting and actually gives all the matches some kind of meaning. And hopefully they'll be with different blokes rather than just, you know, book a tea all the time. Oh well, I won. I unlocked something. Um, the arena, I'm guessing. Austin's won. Austin's got the bell. With no cell anywhere near him. Go figure. Congratulations. Great victory. Please everyone congratulate him. With that said, we have all received a great Christmas present today. The game is back. Ooh, Triple H is back. Nice. So is he going to beat the bejesus out of Austin? Oh, of course, yeah, because it's the Royal Rumble that he wins, isn't it? And then he faces Jericho at WrestleMania. 18. What are we going to get? I am the guy. He is the game, apparently. Being the Royal Rumble. Ah, oh, that's funny, because they were a tag team before he disappeared. Nice. Have a happy New Year. Rick Flair's attire. Armageddon, Winter Plaza. Yeah, let's go with the Armageddon Arena. Keep going with the arenas. Well, there's a turn up for the books then. Hmm. So, just like that, I get pulled out of the blooming match, and then I have a non title match with William Regal on a ladder for absolutely no reason. But. The good thing is, next time I can actually compete, hopefully, in the Royal Rumble match, because I still am not the champion. So, yeah, with that said, um, Royal Rumble, here we come, I suppose. But that will be until next time, so till then, I have been that British guy, and I will see you very soon. Goodbye.